What's up guys, Chris VA Travels, and I'm at the birth site of Matthew Fontaine Mori, also known the, uh, as the Pathfinder of the Seas, and he's a famed oceanographer. He's also the founder of the Science of Meteorology. Pretty neat uh, stone marker they've got here. Yeah, I'm here in Spotsylvania County. I'm at the Chancellorsville Battlefield. And he's gonna walk down this trail. It's probably not even a quarter mile, and it's uh, what's left of it is a birth site. And another little, uh, another plaque over here. And yeah, just talking about, he was uh, one of America's greatest scientists. And yeah, the Maury House down here. And yeah, born out, in, out here in Spotsylvania, but he lived for a time in Fredericksburg. He lived at a couple different residences. Um, he had a, a big house off of Charlotte Street, which is a block over uh, from Hanover. Um, also lived for a time off Lower Caroline Street. So, yeah, and he's famed, like I say, Path, uh, Pathfinder of the Seas. He wrote the first accurate map of ocean currents. This uh, indentation in the ground was his birth home. And you still see some bricks in the ground there. And okay, there are several over here. And uh, yeah, hopefully archeologists ha have done some digging. I'm sure uh, metal detectors have been out here. Pretty neat. And you'll see a bunch of uh, plant life uh, out there. Actually, these uh, these daffodils are, are signs of uh, his residence. Another brick right there. You almost want to grab one, take it with you, but yeah, these bulbs last forever. So yeah, this was his homestead at the time, born here 1806. Over, read this plaque. Yeah, plenty more daffodils kind of all around. So here we are. This was the big uh, monument down in Richmond off Monument Avenue before it was taken down a, a couple years ago. But uh, yeah, a little write up. He wrote The Physical Geography of the Sea in 1855. That was the first modern study of oceanography. And it helped reduce the travel time from New York to San Francisco from 180 days down to 133 days. And it, they used his uh, studies to help when they laid the big transatlantic telegraph line over to Europe. So. All right, guys, that'll do it. Like I say, just a short one. Just wanted to show off his birth site and something cool to check out if you're ever visiting the Chancellorsville Battlefield. And uh, as always, like and subscribe. See you.